Hi there, Jane here with another app review and today we're going to be looking at a game called Smash Bandits and this is a game brought to you by the same makers of Smash Cops. Now this is a crazy racing game where you're smashing your way through America trying to score as high points as you can. Now your controls are one finger controls which is at the bottom as you can see and all you're doing is moving from side to side to control your vehicle. Smash through as many things as you can. All those things with blue arrows above them, you can smash into them. And you can pretty much go anywhere. You can go down roads, dirt tracks. Um, you can go through a jetty and take over a boat and start going in the water with a boat. There's all sorts that you can do. You've got to avoid the cop cars. If they come near you, their car, will, their blue car will turn red. And that means that they're about like that. And they're about to ram you and try and knock you off the road. So just try and avoid that by either knocking them off first or just getting out of their way. Score as many points as you can, because the more points and more things that you smash up, the more money you're going to earn. And the money will help you buy power-ups, and also use tokens if you want to take over again. So I've taken over, because my vehicle's all smashed up, I've now got a cop car to control. Which gets a bit confusing at times when there's loads of cop cars surrounding you, because you forget which one's you. Or I do anyway. But keep going, and see how far you can go, and just ram as much as you can do, smash into everything and see how long you can last. So we'll get in here and get a boat. So now you're doing exactly the same thing but you're controlling a boat in the water. You can still smash everything up. And all this money that you're going to be earning will help you improve your vehicle, buy a better vehicle and also use power-ups which I'll show you in a moment. But you can get things like a head start or a car taser and just basically improve the performance of your vehicle. Oh dear, smash those boats. So that's me done with. Now at the end it'll tell you TV ratings and depending on how good they are is depending on how much of a reward you get and you can see your money's at the top that you've earned. You also level up and unlock things as well along the way. Now the car you start off with is this one and you can upgrade the speed, smash power and handling and then you can improve your car and buy a new car if you want to and it'll always tell you how much it's going to cost you. As you can see there they do get really cool. And then that's the, that's the best car. Your money does build up very quickly so you can buy them some more if you want to within the app as an in-app purchase but if you play the game and keep playing the game you do earn it quite quickly so you don't really need to pay anything out if you don't want to. Then the gadgets that you can do, they are unlocked as well as you play. The stunner gun is, or car is a stunner thing, not gun, is um, unlocked at a level 10, which I'm not near yet. So at the moment I can just get the ram one if I want to. So you just tap it if you want it, and then it'll tell you how much it's going to cost you, and it just automatically comes off your money, and you're using that within the game. But you can also get things, as I say, like head starts. So all these boosts are to improve your chances to last longer, and not get rammed or crash into anything, and score bigger points. And so you just do exactly the same thing each time, but just see how high you can score and how far you can go and how much you can earn. It's all about improving your vehicle and seeing how long you can last. So that is Smash Bandits. Well, let me know in the comments below if you've tried it yet, what you think of it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and bye-bye for now.